for a while there we were wondering, will he? Won't he? Will he be able to make a video or not? It's so busy, first couple of days of college. We both know that. Now. What's going on? Uh, so not so much around here, but I will tell you a little story. A little story about the joys of home ownership. Uh, turns out that oil tanks, external to one's house, can leak and can leak copious amounts of oil into the soil, which can then pollute one's neighbor's basement. And it turns out, and this is important for you to remember later in your life, that homeowner's policies do not cover oil tank leaks. That's a really important thing for you to know. If I could go back in time to myself at 17, 18, right in college, I would point a finger in my face and I would say, homeowner's insurance policies do not cover oil tank leaks. But anyway, I really want a tour of uh, the room. There's posters in the back, there's some like weird dollar bill thing. Uh, it looks maybe like John Lennon in a corner, I'm not really sure. It could very well be like a Native American too. It probably speaks to the resolution of your video camera that John Lennon and a Native American look somewhat similar. Uh, anyway, let's begin with this. You may or may not have heard of Django before. I'm really, really familiar with Django Reinhardt, and you're absolutely right that he's a uh, genius of jazz guitar. As, as you know, I don't need to tell you, you told me, and, and your story checks out. I agree. And I've agreed for quite some time. Uh, you might want to check out a couple other things, too. Um, Charlie Christian is an American jazz guitarist who's, who's widely credited far and wide for a lot of really groundbreaking sort of jazz guitar in the 40s and 50s. And so that might be worth your time. And if you're in the mood for a movie, there's a uh, relatively recent Woody Allen comedy called Sweet and Low Down, which uh, stars Sean Penn as a jazz guitarist who is uh, fascinated with Django Reinhardt and uh, takes place at the same time. And he's always trying to do what Django does and that sort of stuff. And of course, the soundtrack. Yeah. So you should uh, check that out as well. But of course, Limehouse Blues, definitely better than Minor Swing. I mean, that's... Just a fact. So I'm going to recommend Charles Mingus. Uh, Charles Mingus, because we're in a jazzy mood, I guess. And I don't know if he's really studying music, but he's damn interesting. And the thing I really like about Mingus is that he sounds pretty much like he was in real life. Uh, he sounds like a maniac when he's uh, doing his thing. And he pretty much was a maniac. And if you go and you check out things like his Wikipedia article, you can read all sorts of crazy stories about him fighting with the people in his band on stage and like stabbing people and throwing, firing people in the middle of sets and so forth because chord changes were slightly off. And uh, the two albums that I'm going to uh, point you towards are Mingus Ah Um and Mingus Oh Yeah. And in particular, I'd check out the songs Goodbye Pork Pie Hat, uh, Chicken Pie, Chicken Pie. I mean, go listen to Chicken Pie and you'll see exactly what I mean. And of course, uh, Oh Lord, don't let him drop that atomic bomb on me, which is, I think, pretty apropos given geopolitical events and so forth. Yeah, so that's it. Um, you know, I, 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 I can not really hear what the uh, students from Long Island are saying in that other video, and I'm pretty sure that I can just go in my mind back to, like, late Friday night rides home from the city with all the club kids and pretty much get a pretty good feeling of it. Uh, my advice to you would be that uh, you should probably go and try to socialize. And, uh, you know, make friends. Uh, I've got great friends that I made in college that are still dear, dear friends. Many more than I still talk to from high school, to be perfectly honest. Actually, that's not true. It's about equal. Yeah, so I'll see you in uh, two weeks. And uh, hopefully the classes are going well. Hang in there. Take it easy. Oh, and of course...